welcome back to the vlog. Making a quick trip to the store. Let's go get the kid some milk and some bananas. All right, let me go grab my keys because uh, I forgot them. I just got to the store, but I'm having uncontrollable allergies. I'm gonna sneeze again. <coughs> oh, good grief. Anyway, give me just a couple of minutes to run in here and grab a few things, and then we'll, uh, We'll get back to the house and sit down and have a chat real quick. All right, we're headed back to the house. I picked up milk and bananas and a few other things. Gonna try a new recipe tonight. So, uh, see you guys in a bit. Made it home. Now I gotta get the um, groceries out of the car, which there's quite a bit, well, not quite a bit, there's four bags. I'm gonna set the camera down to pick it all up though. So, interesting question, I think. How many of you guys go to the grocery store and refuse to make more than one trip into the house? Like when you get home, you spent $300 and you just like, you get all the bags and you put them on one arm and you're just like, I'm only doing this in one trip. I know you guys do that. I do that. It's pretty common, I think. Oh, it's dark in here. That's not even better. Maybe this one? Oh, also not even better. All right, I'm going to fix the light, put the groceries away, and then I'm going to cook for you guys. And despite this uh, not being a cooking channel, I'm going to cook something special. Maybe the light right here will be good. Oh, oh, oh yeah, there we go. So I'm going to put the groceries away and then I'll be right back to cook dinner for you guys. Here we go. All right, guys. So the other day, uh, Jeff and I watched some Piper blush and I know everybody's familiar with Piper blush. If not, I'll throw a link, but you know, <clears throat> anyway, Piper blush and she made poutine she lives in Canada poutine is a thing up there I thought it looked delicious not Piper well I mean she does too but um, you know the whole poutine thing so uh, we're gonna cook some tonight compliments are uh, of Piper blush you know because yeah anyway I found a recipe here online um, and I'm gonna follow that but essentially what poutine is, consists of very few things. It's french fries, cheese curds, and gravy. And gravy is the only thing we actually have to make. Like the fries just go in a thing and fry. So let's get this made. <laughs> Okay, so now that the <clears throat> fries and everything are done cooking, fries, gravy, it's really pretty simple. Let me set this camera down and I'm going to make a plate. First we're going to take our cheese curd bag and I'm going to cut that open because, you know, cheese curds. 
Now, I'm gonna take and I'm gonna put on some fries. Put down a little bit of fries. Then we're gonna put on some cheese curds. Kind of let those marry with the fries a little bit. Then we're gonna put some more fries on top. So you have this with some cheese curds on top of that. Then we're gonna get some gravy. Gravy. Now we're going to go deliver this to the wife and see what she thinks. Okay, so, so what is this again? This is a Canadian dish called poutine. Piper Blush learned me and Jeff what it was. The gravy is really good. Let's try it with one of them here cheese curds. I don't know why I talked like that. I'm sorry. It's good. I like it. All right, Canadians, there you go. You made one good thing, other than Celine Dion. Actually, Canada has lots of cool YouTubers. In fact, probably probably 80% of my feed is from Canada. Oh, man. I totally just sat here and did all this with, uh, without recording. Well, let's give this a try. It's pretty good. It needs like some barbecue chicken or something. But good job, Canada. You got Peter McKinnon, Celine Dion, and Poutine. I was originally gonna dress up like Piper Blush for this, <clears throat> but um, I don't have a bra, and they demonetize if you're not wearing a bra. So I didn't want to get demonetized. Jeff opted out of it because he thinks it would be embarrassing. You knew this was happening. This is invasive. You knew it was happening. This is invasive. All right, so the Piper Blush method is you take your plate. Wow, I gotta zoom this out. Here we go. You take your plate, you put some fries on it. Then you put some cheese on it. Then you put some fries on it. Then you put some cheese on it. Okay. And then the gravy's on the stove. Goosebumps. Yeah, I said earlier that I was gonna dress up as Piper Blush uh, to do this cooking experiment, but um, if I didn't wear a bra, they were gonna demonetize me. <laughs> this looks like really good gravy. It's uh, the only part of this that was made from, uh, from, from scratch. All right, Jeff. Do the Canadians have another good thing, or is it just Celine Dion? Celine <laughs> 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 Is this turkey gravy? It's made from chicken and beef broth. <laughs> All right, he's back after the microwave. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. That's right, these cheese curds are getting softer. It's good, it's good. It's not fair. It's like the Canadians, this is obviously an American thing. <laughs> I can know the Canadians did it and they gave it a nice French name. Oh, you're gonna get me demonetized. <laughs> All this erotic black tea. I think it needs like barbecue chicken. Everything needs barbecue chicken. Once you sit, like that's the threshold. If something's gonna have a bunch of toppings and it's relatively cheap, might as well just pick up a case of Jack Daniels. <laughs> it's barbecue chicken, just, yeah. dump, just dump it right Pick on top. Pork. There you have it, kids. Poutine's a winner. Thanks, Canada. You gave us Peter McKinnon, Celine Dion, and Poutine. Oh. Hey, guys. If you like the content, hit like on the video. If you like what's here, subscribe to the channel so you can come back and see more of what we got going on. If you're interested in supporting us, check out the Patreon. We have a Discord server. So if you're a member of Patreon, you get to uh, have special privileges in the chat over there where you get to hang out with us all the time. And I've got some boxes to open, which I believe one of these is a thing we're giving away on Patreon this month. So go check it out. You don't get to see what's in this one until the next video, though. So uh, see you guys later. Almost dropped it. Could have stabbed myself in the foot.